Well, all right. Um, you can tr use every method under the sun, and it still won't export. And I'm just going to show you. Uh, let's first go to the shading, the method that was shown to me most recently on how to do this, um, but it still didn't help. Um, you got to do the uh, connect the lines. Uh, you oh, oh, you're doing such a good job mode uh, that this offers with connect the lines. I, I feel this kind of interface is the most condescending kind of interface you could possibly do to people, but this is what they've done. Rainbow Cube 3, now we connect the lines and connect it between this and this. Oh, you're doing such a good job. Oh. All right, so we got that. And it can show, here's these different modes. This will show it as a wireframe, this will show it as a solid, and these show different other modes. Well, these modes don't do any good. This is just a view. It still hasn't actually put the texture on the cube. Um, let's go with texture paint. Let's change this from material to single image. Let's go open. And we'll put it there. We can see it's correctly in UV editing as well. Um, it's in shading, it's in texture paint, it's in modeling when you when you have it viewed this way. But uh, when you go to export, it's it's not going to be uh, it's not going to be there. Oh wait, I better cancel out of this because I need to make this bigger because it starts off as some really tiny item. Let's go like this. Let's hit C to make it to make it like this. C. And now um, I'm just going to save as my, my butt. I'm going to save this, save this, save this. God, why do you have to click it so many times? Well, because it's in a mode. All right. Nothing is standard on this. Okay. And yeah, I'll call it my butt. And it'll go into here because it can never remember... Uh, directory locations. All the, the only directory it remembers is uh, my documents. That's it. So okay, uh, export my butt. We're gonna go into here. We're gonna go import 3D model and we're gonna import my butt. Import. There we go. And as you see, it's still a blank cube. So sort of at a loss. Um, I was originally using two point, Blender 2.8 because I was able to find some of the the simple things like uh, like like scaling, you know, it has everything handy for tinkering with your object. 2.7 it's more steps to edit anything, but uh, I just, but if in 2.8 there's, if it's, I don't know, if it's that difficult to, to actually export something with a texture on it, I'll probably switch back to 2.7 and then have to relearn 2.8 all over again when it becomes the main version. Though, I, I don't know why they even called it 2.8. It should be called 3.0 or something because it's such a radically different interface. Anyway, blah, blah, blah.